Hi everyone, welcome back to our expert series on AI. In today's episode, I'm gonna answer questions on everyone's lips. How can I make money from generative AI? I'll share some billion dollar Gen AI use cases and explain how you can turn the technology's potential into real business results. Well, shortly after GPT-4 was released, I think about two years ago, um, some academics at University of Pennsylvania, alongside some um, uh, researchers from OpenAI, actually saw a kind of systematic approach to investigating this question. They took some statistics that the, uh, the US Department of Labor published every year about all of the kind of roles that people um, perform in the US economy and all of the tasks that each of those roles perform and systematically went through all of those tasks, all of those roles and looked at how much of that task could be impacted or improved with uh, the, tech, the GPT uh, level technology. What they found is that with GPT-4 alone, just with the generative AI model alone, the uplift, uplift was relatively modest. They saw that about 20% of all tasks in the economy could be improved. But when they combine generative AI plus additional software, the, uh, they estimated around 40% of all tasks in the US economy could be improved. And that's really uh, a staggering uh, opportunity. Generative AI has a huge role to play in improving customer experience. If we take just one narrow use case, support and help desk functions, often simple queries from customers can take an incredibly long amount of time for them to be answered because actually the kind of standard operating procedures, the documentation for our products and services uh, is so big. We have, we have complex product, we have complex services. Generative AI can massively speed up the time it takes uh, a customer service representative or an automated system to find the relevant answer for that customer. And that's just one narrow use case. There are many different settings from customer onboarding uh, to um, processing customer documentation to personalizing uh, customers' products and service recommendations and across the client lifecycle. There are countless opportunities for generative AI to make meaningful improvements. There are really countless opportunities in this space. Um, when you look at most kind of operations functions, um, you know, back office, middle office functions, they're effectively um, knowledge worker tasks. You know, text, language is being processed and created to process a case, to process a trade, to process a customer um, through um, you know, an end-to-end -end kind of business process. So um, as a you know, really excellent technology to process, synthesize, and generate language, there's huge opportunities there for generative AI to accelerate that end-to-end -end journey. Thank you.